Hello everyone, welcome to the channel Rad here from Radko Tarot and this is going to be Aries and Aries Moon and Aries Rising monthly tarot reading for September 2018 and while I'm shuffling the cards guys in case you do want a personal reading with me <clears throat> my website is written is written down below in the description of this video and also don't forget about the summers and sale which concerns the 30 minute um, service and it adds 10 minutes to the 30 minute uh, purchase. So this is going to be a, a seven card spread here and let me cut, let me cut the cards and the first one which is going to be the first position that we're going to uh, observe it regards to um, circumstances which will have an impact upon your month or rather like a past circumstances which will have an impact upon your month the second card it, it represents at uh, the core of the situation not the core of the situation excuse me but the uh, general topic and general theme for your month here Aries is for September third card represents mm, the intentions or uh, the best possible way of uh, uh, the, the the best things you can achieve rather this is the outlook for the future or what is possible to be accomplished should you go for it uh, and it is entirely um, kind of like a, a card which depends on your choosing here you may choose to go for it you may choose not to go for it it, it is entirely up to you the fourth card here repre represents the best possible course of actions you know regarding the theme uh, of and the topic of the month the fifth card it is um, regarding the attitude of the people which are involved in your situation. So what attitude these people has towards you. The sixth card represents the challenges to be taken for the month. And the last one represents the final outcome or how the month is going to be finalized. How you are going to be able to wrap this one up. So let's see what you got here. Now the first one that resembles the um, past circumstances which will have an impact upon your month, that will be the Two of Wands. And this is a, a fantastic card of unfolding and opportunities in the sense of that this card gives us an idea here, Aries, is, is that you have built up either something when you were looking uh, for a, a way to make an initiative or to establish a certain undertaking. And this card points that the research and the reconnoitering you have to put behind it, it is yet to come. So uh, that card itself for us for the duration of the month gives us a um, a glimpse of understanding that it is yet the best way possible for approaching either your career or either your relationship is, is yet to be revealed to you. So if you haven't figured out how you should act or react upon certain circumstances uh, which happened to you recently, you know, don't you worry guys, the uh, September is going to present a an opportunity for you to make the things right in, in case they are not going into a, a very favorable um, direction. And this card also regards to um, a very tenacious approach. So you may have been tenacious into a certain undertakings uh, in your life and that tenacity you had uh, may play a, a vital role here and it does depend how unyielding you are toward it because those who are unforgivably unyielding toward that particular situation either career related or relationship related well they will have to suffer some losses so try to uh, be able to kind of obtain or uh, place yourself in a standpoint of a, a certain margin for a compromise so the team itself and kind of it's no wondering that we do have that card here which is the six of um, the six of wands a very good follower to the two of wands so uh, that will be a month this card represents the month itself and that will be a month of reaching a, a milestone receiving accommodations rewards for your work and as well for some of you Aries is, is where a helping hand finally arrives and helps you to cope with your difficulties you need to know that this is going to be extraordinary month in a sense of that you are about to reach a, a peak of experience 
if that is regarding uh, relationship wise or a, a milestone if it is regarding to your career very important thing however with the with the six of wands is even though the experience is is tremendous in the sense of that you even may not believe that you are reaching th this uh, um, this kind of a, a good results at your behalf um, you need to know that the work is far from done so if you mobilize yourself accordingly you can even uh, achieve great results but these greater results will follow uh, probably in October maybe November or December as well so that is a, um, a huge impulse to uh, not re not regain back control but improve in any way into your career or into your relationship and as we can see here that you are trying to initiate something I have no doubts just looking at these couple of cards that you will be able to establish the initiative here and as well you know uh, based on that initiative you will be able to reach the checkpoint the milestone you require in order to consolidate what was thus achieved according to the undertaking then the next card represents what you can additionally go for six of pentacles here tells us only one thing is that i'm um, simultaneously with that initiation with that initiative excuse me that you are um reconnoitering and researching to do you can also aim for the duration of the mode to resolve some uh um, uh, to resolve some you know lingering um, disputes lingering uh, predicaments that uh, you do have either with other people or either with our situations but they do not demand resolution in uh, at all costs so you can kind of postpone them but this card here points us to that you will have the time to do so uh, uh, and uh, it is kind of advisable because uh, if you accomplish the condition that the card gives you to resolve those um, those predicaments and those issues which are lingering and and, and are thus far postponed uh, you will be able to cope as well with um, the more unpleasant side of the matter um, in a in a sense of that you know every single undertaking has its its pleasant activities and unpleasant activities and by you resolving those lingering issues will allow you to cope much more easily with the unpleasant side of the matter with the dirty work should I say that way so let's go to the next card and see how is the best way that you can utilize um, the uh, the momentum that you do have here and capitalize on the success which the six of wands uh, promises you that will be the eight of cups very important card to be said because this card resembles in your particular case is that even if one thing doesn't work out that should not uh, place you into a state of despondency and loss of faith but rather you should try to approach it from a, a brand different angle because the eight of cups is about a um as in your actions and intentions from your behalf it means that you always have to seek the way and even in some of, of um, in some books i have read that the six of uh, the, the eight of cups excuse me is the card marking that one is setting back on track with the the right path that they need to follow in order to reach their destination and it is exactly what you need to do here guys if it doesn't if the if the undertaking doesn't budge out from one angle you can approach it from a different angle don't be afraid as well to bring some connections and friends into the matter which are willing to help you because it's going to bring you to a um it will go for a long way and as well when we do have that card regarding regardless of how uh, unsatisfiable for the lack of better terms one situation could be in one moment that doesn't mean that this situation is going to be forever that way which means that you should not kind of drop off your clamor and on top of that as well you need to know and believe as well of course because it's all about self self belief that the best is yet to come so a brighter future awaits you it is what the card points if you don't give up on your dreams and on your agendas aims and goals as well so uh, the um, <clears throat> attitude of the people around you that we do have which are involved in your situations and this is where you have to be careful now someone else with, with the seven of swords someone else or society of people will try to as well capitalize on your um, on your success 
and they may try to extort a, a bigger portion of the reward that they actually deserve. So you have to be very careful of a, a sneaky people. Well, you don't have to be very worried about those who are sneaking because you rarely see them, but those who are slinky should be the one who truly um, kind of like attract your attention. And those who are slinky, very indecisive, you know, trying to kind of put their game in front of others, etc., etc., has to be put into their rightful place which is a, a place of submission in that particular case because you will be the one who needs to lead that particular force that particular fro project and uh, <clears throat> people who does not um, in uh, people who are insubordinate here um, it's kind of like uh, they, they should not be tolerated that is my point and we do have seven of swords a little bit more radical and direct approach to what the situation like slamming with a fist upon the table you know or confronting them directly it's kind of advisable for you Aries so you can overcome the um, the opposition should I say that way it's not even the opposition but let's say the surreptitious um, <clears throat> the surreptitious action, actions which are going on and are using your um, your undertaking as a um, as a curtains so they can hide their work hide their work behind it the uh, challenges that you need to cope with that will be the strength card and that is kind of very close uh, closely related with the two of wands because the strength card is all about perseverance uh, perseverance yeah through a, a patience and through uh, self-belief through having clamor in in your deeds so as I said that you will be rather tenacious, you know, or that tenacity from the previous month to execute the project, to uh, to seal the deal with your relationships, etc, etc. As it's carry on, this month rather will ask you to be a little bit more, um, more patient and collective with your decision. <clears throat> and with your actions as well. Uh, one more thing to be said here with the um, with the strength card is that you may be provoked to explain yourself way too much, especially if your undertaking involves other people, involves other people, excuse me. And if that's the case, you should not feel yourself too much obliged to uh, to do so. On the other hand, the strength card could play a role as a hyperactivity and could play a role as a, a hyper eagerness to take on the challenge, you know, and to, um, to jump into it without taking under consideration the minor details. And those who do that may have in fact charge toward their personal destruction. Not, to, not in this particular month, but these people who has the surreptitious intentions will use any single... Um, any single opportunity to build up a case against you, Aries, and to um, kind of like you know um, make use of 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 your liabilities, <clears throat> if if you have any, and every person have a, a certain uh, liabilities, and then uh, how you're gonna wrap this one up? or how we finalize the month here, that will be the Two of Cups. Very positive card. It does look like that you will be able to settle with those people which are kind of having those slinky and surreptitious intentions for your job, because the Two of Cups points that at the end, the poisonous and noxious, noxious environment which is surrounding your undertaking will be finally uh, <clears throat> pushed away and you will rather surround uh, surround your agenda with uh, people who are very faithful and with people who are willing only to help and to make some certain not even emotional connection but let's say connection with uh, with your agenda from a, a pure candor behind it in a sense of that they are going to realize that if you are the one who, uh, if you prevail, everyone prevails. There will be something in it for everybody. That's why these people will give a hundred percent from their behalf so you can establish your deed. And as we have that card here, probably the deed that you are trying to initiate and establish as well is for the common good. It is not for your personal good as well. And I should have, uh, and I should have mentioned that into the six of wands because the guy in the uh, who is sitting at the horse some people sees it as a uh, um, 
liberator he liberates a, a village of captive people you know so yeah it's it's kind of like even though there will be a lot uh, there will be a lot of for you in it as well there is for the people who are involved in it as well and it's just um, only those who are faithful to faithful to the enterprise and to the undertaking will remain surrounding you and from there it looks like the you will have the clearance here to proceed from the milestone moving on forward to its imminent success either relationship wise or career wise so uh, just to wrap this one up and to summarize that reading guys uh Aries, this month you should utilize upon settle down um predicaments and disagreements which you had postponed until this very moment also uh self belief and clamor in your actions it's uh, uh it's for, it's imperative for the success of your undertaking and if it doesn't work out uh from the first try you have to try a new cuz the murphy law says that if something works out from the tr first try obviously it's either something you don't want or you have made a, a terrible mistake with your plans somewhere along the, along the way. And if someone uh, does raise your suspicious here for the duration of the month, do not be afraid to simply um, constrain them being an influence into your undertakings. So that being said, Aries, this was your monthly tarot reading for September 2018. I hope you enjoyed it and you liked it. And in case, again, you are interested in a private reading with me, my website is written down below in the description of the video and it is there where you are going to find the full list and the prices of my services as well as there is a um, summer and sale that is running right now which adds 10 minutes instantly on the 30 minute service so i hope that this uh, reading satisfies you guys and see you around until then bye